Hi, hello and welcome back again to our YouTube channel Excel Bus Software Testing where you will learn in easy simple way. So our today's topic is test environment, its management and best practices to follow. So let's get started. What is software environment? The environment of a software refers to the infrastructure or set of the conditions required for the software to function correctly. It includes the hardware, software and network configuration that the software needs to operate correctly. The software environment is important because it can affect the software's performance, stability and security as well. Now let's see what are the types of software environment. Development environment. This environment is used by developers to write and test their code before it is merged into the main code base. It is typically includes the development tools and code repository. Testing environment This environment is used by testers to perform functional regression and performance testing. It is designed to replicate a production environment as closely as possible, including the hardware, software and all the configurations. Staging environment This environment is used for user acceptance testing and pre-production testing. It is similar to the production environment but with a limited number of users and reduced data volume. Production environment This is live environment where the software is deployed and used by end users. It must be stable, secure and highly available. Disaster recovery environment This environment is designed to replicate the production environment in case of disaster or outage. It includes backup redundant system and fell over mechanism to ensure business continuity. Sandbox environment This environment is used for exploratory testing and experiments. It is separate from the other environments and can be used for testing new features or configurations without impacting the main code base or database. Let's understand what is test environment now. A test environment refers to the setup or infrastructure in which software testing is carried out. It includes the hardware, software, network and other components required to execute the software being tested in a control and isolated environment. A test environment is created to simulate the production environment where the software will eventually be de deployed so that tester can verify that the software works as intended and it is to identify and fix any issues before it is released to the end users. Let's understand how to set up this test environment. Setting up a test environment can vary depending on the specific requirements and needs of the software being tested. However, the following are some general steps you can follow to set up the test environment. Define the objectives and requirement of the test environment. Identify the purpose of the environment, the type of the testing that will be carried out on the software and the tools and the resources required and the expected outcomes. Choose the hardware and software components. Decide on the hardware and software components needed to run the software being tested. This includes servers, database, operating systems and other required software applications. Create an isolated network. Set up an isolated network to ensure that the test environment is separate from the production environment and to prevent any unintended impact on the production environment. Install and configure the software. Install and configure the required software applications and tools. This may include testing frameworks, debugging tools, automation tools and other testing utilities. Test the environment. Test the environment to ensure that everything is functioning as expected. This may include running sample tests, validating the connectivity and ensuring that the test environment meets the defined objectives and requirements. Document the environment. Document the test environment setup including the hardware and software components, configurations and any other relevant information. This will be useful for future reference and for replicating this test environment in future. What is test environment management? Test environment management is a process of planning, creating, maintaining and optimizing the test environment to support the software testing activities. It involves the managing the hardware, software, data and other resources required for testing 
as well as ensuring that the test environment is stable, secure and available whenever is needed. First one is environment planning. Identifying the hardware, software and other resources required for testing and developing a plan for creating and maintaining the test environment. Environment setup. Creating and configuring the test environment to ensure it meets the testing needs including installing and configuring the softwares and tools required for the testing. Environment maintenance. Ensuring the test environment is up to date, stable and secure, including managing system upgrades, patches and backups. Environment monitoring. Monitoring the test environment to detect any issues or performance problems and taking corrective actions on it. Environment optimization. Continuously improving the test environment by optimizing the resource usage, identifying and resolving the bottlenecks and automating the manual tasks. Overall, effective test environment management is critical for ensuring the quality and reliability of the software being tested. By providing a stable and efficient test environment, it enables tester to perform testing activities effectively and efficiently, resulting in better software quality and customer satisfaction. Why this management is important? First of all, consistency. Test environment management helps to ensure that the test environment is consistent and with the production environment. This consistency is critical for accurate testing results because it provides a realistic representation of how the software will behave in the actual production environment. Efficiency By providing a reliable and efficient test environment, tester can perform testing activities with minimal interruptions which saves time and reduces the cost. Quality An optimized test environment can help to identify issues early in the development cycle which can reduce the overall risk of defects and improve the quality of the software being tested. Reproducibility An environment that is well documented and consistently maintained can be easily replicated, enabling testers to reproduce and resolve the issues quickly and efficiently. Compliance Test environment management is often necessary to comply with the regulatory requirements and industry standards. Overall, effective test environment management is essential for ensuring the quality, reliability and security of the software being tested. It can help to reduce the risk of defects, saves the time and cost and even improve the customer satisfaction. Best Practices of Test Environment Management Identify the document requirements. Before setting up the test environment, it is important to identify the document requirements such as hardware, software, configurations, test data and other resources. This information should be kept up to date and readily available for future references. Standardize the environment. Standardizing the test environment helps to ensure the consistency and simplifies the process of reproducing issues. This includes standardizing hardware, software versions and configurations across the test environment. Automate the environment setup. Automating the setup of the test environment helps to save the time and reduce the errors. Using tools like configuration management or provisioning tools can speed up the process and ensures the consistency. Implement version control. Version control helps to manage changes to the test environment and ensures that the changes are tracked and auditable. It is especially important when multiple testers are working on the same environment. Monitor and maintain the environment. Monitoring the test environment is crucial to ensure that it is stable, secure and available when needed. This includes monitoring hardware resources, software performance and security updates. Regular maintenance tasks such as backups and disaster recovery testing should also be performed. Test the environment. Before testing the software, it is important to test the environment itself to ensure that it is working as expected. This includes verifying the connectivity, validating the configurations and ensuring that all the required tools and resources are available. Provide access control. Providing access control to the test environment helps to ensure that only authorized individuals can access and modify the environment. This reduces the risk of unauthorized access 
or change that could impact the testing result. Overall, the effective test environment management requires careful planning, attention to the details, and thorough understanding of software being tested. By following these best practices, tester can create and maintain a reliable and efficient test environment that supports accurate testing results and reduce the overall risk of defect. So this is it for today. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Please share it, this video to your family and friends. If you have any queries, please write down to us. Stay connected with us. We post videos on every Tuesday and Friday. Till then, happy testing. Bye-bye.